from the uh, famous uh, locality for fluorite in South Africa, uh, Remfas Mark. These are not the light green ones, as you can see. These are sort of a, almost a sea green to bluish grayish green fluorites. Uh, but they have the form which is quite typical to Rimfos mark. They almost look like little pyramids. Slight dusting of quartz running across this. And when we look into these crystals, into the fluorite crystals, you'll find tiny cubes of pyrite trapped inside these. There you can see almost that yellowish material would be a tiny pyrite cube trapped in it. This one has a very thin crust, very thin matrix, uh, silica or quartz matrix, and then some of the quartz uh, growing on top of the fluorite. From a display point of view on a turntable flat would be this effect looking from the top down you'd have this effect of course with with good lighting you'd be able to see more through these uh, uh, fluorite crystals and you can actually see there is some kind of a patterning inside them and also you have these little pyrite cubes trapped inside these these were not that abundant these were actually quite rare uh, as far as I know uh, from the deposits of Rimfas Mark. What we would be more familiar with is the lovely apple green um, fluorite uh, pyramid, pyramidal form. And that, that is one of the telltale uh, marks of this locality. Mind you, there, there are other fluorites, not just uh, pyramidal ones, which came out of this deposit. Rimfas Mark, Northern Cape of South Africa, fluorite quartz on a very thin matrix.